Hi, K1s. Welcome back to the virtual library. Let's see what book you've clicked on this time. You clicked on Mighty Machines, A Hole in the Road, written by Philip Arda and Tig Sutton. This is going to be, I think, about construction. A hole in the road. Oh no, a water pipe has burst and a fountain of water has made a crack in the road. Here comes a minibus carrying the road menders. They will fix the pipe and mend the crack in the road. So they're going to come and fix the pipe which is underneath and fix the crack in the road. A road mender switches off the water with a special key. It's quite a big long key but he has to put it down into the ground and twist it around until the water stops shooting out. Here comes the digger to dig a hole in the road so the road can be fixed because there is a crack here now. The road is broken. The arm of the digger is lowered to the ground. It scoops up the earth and digs a hole. Here comes a big dump truck to take away the earth. The digger fills the back of the dump truck with earth and pieces of broken pipe. Can you see where the pipe was broken here? Well, that has to go now and then a new pipe will be laid. Here comes a flatbed truck. See, it has a flat bit, just like a bed, with new pipes on the back. So the old pipes get thrown away and the new pipes get fitted. The driver jumps out of his cab. That's the front bit here where he sits and drives and pulls back the covers. Here comes a forklift truck to unload the pipes. I wonder why the man can't take the pipes down and carry them. Why do you think? Why do you think they have to use the forklift truck to unload the pipes? Are you thinking the same as me, that maybe these are too heavy? So the forklift truck has to unload them. The forks at the front of the forklift truck go up and they lift the pipes off the truck and put them down on the ground. Here comes a crane to put the pipes into the hole. And you see the crane has like arms, fingers like us. The, crane, the crane's grab opens wide and then closes around the pipe like giant fingers. It swivels around, it moves round and lowers the pipes into place. Here comes a dumper truck to fill in the hole. It has some cement in here or some, some soil, some sand. Oh, earth, it says here, look. The dumper truck pours earth in the hole to cover the pipes. Here comes the paver to lay a new piece of road over the hole. So they put the pipe down here and then they put the earth inside and then this one comes along to lay the new piece of road. The paver covers the hole with hot, sticky tar. And then, to let keep it flat, because you don't want a bumpy road, here comes the road roller to flatten the tar. Oh dear, what's happened to this man? I think this cat and dog are having a cat and dog chase throughout the story. I keep seeing them on every page. And you know what I can see? Where the number of the pages are, it's like a hat, a hard helmet construction hat too. The road roller makes the road smooth and flat. The pipe has been fixed and the hole in the road has been mended. Here comes the minibus again. It is back to collect the road menders. They are all heading home for tea. They've finished their job. Even the dog is heading home. The end. So we found out about lots of different types of transport here that all work together in a system to fix a small crack in the road. But we had to have lots of big machines here, didn't we, to fix that hole. Thank you for listening, K1s. See you again soon in the virtual library. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.